Hey guys, Rich here at Flippin' for a Living, and I'm gonna share with you quickly a short video that is life-changing if you are a thrifter or a reseller or just like a good deal or wanna make a little extra money on the side. I'm gonna give some great tips for selling on Facebook Marketplace. Um, we're gonna go over it real quick. Um, if you're watching on TikTok or Instagram, unfortunately this video is gonna cut out at 60 seconds because that's, that's all they let you do, 60 seconds. So if you wanna see the whole video, go to YouTube, check out Flippin' for a Living, F-L-I-P-P-I-N, the number four, A-L-I-V-I-N. Did I spell it right? I hope so. Anyways, the link should be up top in the TikTok and uh, Instagram profiles. So let's go over real quickly what I spent 80 bucks on and I'm gonna make $500 on, almost all locally, very little effort. Starting off right here with what I'm sitting in. Um, couldn't even believe it. These guys had a pair of these rocking, swiveling outdoor chairs for 10 bucks. They're in perfect shape. This is, I originally thought, oh, I'll quickly flip those locally for 50 bucks. Um, then I'm thinking 60 and now I'm up to 75. I think I can get $75 for this. So $65 profit off of these two chairs. And um, if I put them up for 50, I would sell them within three minutes. I might actually go live and do that to show how fast you can make money. Um, or I maybe should be greedy and go for the $75. Well, as it turns out, I didn't ask 50 or 75. I shot for the moon and asked 125. The wife and I decided, hey, let's get as much as we can. If we don't sell them, we got only 10 bucks invested, we can keep them, we can use them all summer. But as it turns out, in the first couple hours, I had seven people inquire and a couple more since then, but I have someone coming to pick them up tomorrow at 125 bucks. So we made $115 all profit, no packing, no shipping, no fees. Anyways, this is 10 of the $80 I spent. What else did we get? Right there behind me, the Wii Rock Band full kit. Um, it's got the pedal, it's got the microphone, it's got a guitar, it's got the game, it's in great shape. They were asking 20 bucks and uh, I got them down to $15. I'm easily gonna make $100 profit on that alone. Don't believe me, just check out sold listings on eBay, always check out sold listings so you're not overpricing or underpricing what you're selling. Uh, this little bike right here, you can obviously ride it, little tricycle, or have an adult push you around. They had that for five bucks. I'm gonna sell that locally, $25. That will sell today. And right now I wanna say the main way, the quickest way to make money on Facebook is to keep this in mind. And sometimes I think I'm stupid for sharing this, but it really should be common knowledge buy and sell things that people need to use on an almost daily basis. A couple times a week, a few times a week, and sometimes daily basis. Buy those type of things. That's what everybody's looking for. They're not looking for a vintage fork or plate to hang on their wall in the, in the hallway and walk past it a couple times a day and say, oh, nice plate. One out of a hundred people is looking for that. Everybody else is looking for something that they need right now and that's what you want to shop for that's my main tip when it goes to reselling on facebook marketplace so all this from one garage sale you guys it was a great one they don't always go like this but when you find one with these prices and this variety you got to snap it up uh this wiggle car or plasma car they call them five bucks on that i actually had one yesterday bought it for five no i paid 10 for it but i sold it for 35 dollars almost instantly like I had five people that wanted it. So I'll probably just message the other people that missed out on this one. I'll message them back. This one's not quite as good shape. So I'll only ask 30 bucks, but I won't even have to post this one for sale because you kind of got to keep a little Rolodex of people and what they're looking for. And if it's something that sells really quickly and you had a lot of inquiries, tip number two, make sure and keep their name so that you get another one. You call them back. You don't even have to post up for sale instant $25 profit same thing with this you guys this um, infant or toddler backpack carrier I bought one of these at value village for 20 bucks I sold it for $70 it took about a week $50 all profit because I sold it locally um, that one was uh, even flow 
This one is actually Mountain Equipment Company, which is a uh, better brand name than Evenflow or whatever I said. Yeah, I think it's Evenflow. Anyways, 10 bucks on that. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the sun cover, which would put it through the roof, but I'll easily get probably, you know, again, 75, maybe I'll shoot for 100 on that, guaranteed. And again, I could put that up for 50 bucks right now and it would sell almost instantly. No packing, no shipping, no fees. It's all profit when you're selling it locally on Facebook Marketplace. Uh, this saw right here, this is what caught my attention originally in their ad. He had 25 bucks on it. Um, he gave it to me for 20. Is that in my picture? Yeah. He gave it to me for 20 bucks and, oh, well, there it is, $25. I've sold so many of these ranging from 50 to $75, depending on the brand and the condition. I'll, I'll just throw this one up for 60 bucks, make a quick $40. That'll sell today again. Yes, it's nice to have gas powered everything, but not everybody can afford a hundred or $150 for a gas powered whipper snipper. So if you can get one for two bucks, that's electric grab it it's another local sale it's another quick sale because of the time of year i'm gonna get 20 25 bucks for that and yeah what are you saying to yourself right now oh what 18 dollars for all that hassle misconception number three it doesn't have to be a hassle to sell on facebook marketplace you guys every time i give all these tips i, I second guess that i should do it especially in my area because now people are going to go to garage sales and they're going to steal all those amazing finds that i should be getting myself and making all the money myself and now other people are going to do it because i've seen it happen over the years i now have people who are viewers turn into competitors and now they're friends but still competitors Ugh. anyways um 18 dollars but why with the hassle right no it takes 60 seconds to post this on marketplace if someone is giving you a one-click response okay there's a lot of if you've ever been on facebook there's responses where it's like i'm interested is this still available and they just click one button and say that ignore those people i'm telling you right now pretend they don't even exist keep it sweet short and simple when you're talking to them if they send you one of those send them back a, a one word response yes no whatever and if they start actually asking questions, then maybe spend some time on them. But don't waste a lot of time. I would say one out of 10 people who actually respond to your Facebook post are actually interested in it. So you don't wanna waste a lot of time on those people who are using the one-click responses. So easy money, 18 bucks, maybe $23 profit. I will sell that. I'll just leave it out on my front steps and say, toss the cash in the mailbox or send me an e-transfer. Virtually no effort whatsoever to make that money. Uh, 60 seconds to post it and 10 seconds to put it on my front steps is how I like to do it on local sales. And that's very popular right now with COVID. Contactless um, transactions, right? So everybody's doing it. This drill right here, you got to be careful buying drills. This is not a great brand name, but it is cordless. It does have two batteries. I flat out asked the guy and I trust him. I'm like, are those batteries working? Like, and he's like, well, actually one of them doesn't really work and the other one works great. So you want to make sure you have at least one good working battery. But at $5, even if the batteries weren't working at all, this charger alone would probably sell for 25 or 30 bucks on eBay or Amazon. But if you can flip it locally, do it first, right? So I'll sell that for 25 or $30. I don't think I'll have an issue getting that for another quick, easy 20 or $25 profit. Same with this DVD player. It was nice to have a remote with it stuff people use every day or several times a week right this stuff in here um these sell all day long for 25 30 bucks locally depending on the brand but be careful some of them are worth substantially more than that you want to do some comps later i didn't comp that one i just knew it was a minimum 25 dollars um it could be a lot more when i check out the actual model number on ebay i don't know what's up with this but it was also there for one dollar it's a vintage wrestling figure. It's uh, Ted DiBiase, and he's very um, not socially conscious, it looks like, based on his face right now. But uh, it's actually peeled off, so I might have to try and find some kind of um, modeling paint or something to paint his face because this will actually sell for about 50 bucks or more. And I only paid a dollar for that. Uh, last. But not least, I think, last thing, yeah, this Crokinole board. You can see right there, I paid $5 for that. I sold several of these um, 
25 30 35 dollars this one has all the pieces even a chest set so another easy 20 25 dollars profit no packing no shipping no fees all profit so that is it you guys you do the math i did it already 80 bucks on all that stuff and it's going to all sell for 500 dollars and pretty much all locally so go give it a try just don't do it in my town um I'm gonna have to get some colors. I'm gonna have to get some colors so that you know it's my territory. You can't come into my territory. Um, you know, start the old rivalry, the Crips and the Bloods or something, whatever. I don't know. Just stay off my turf if you're gonna use my tips. No, I'm just kidding. There's plenty of inventory for all of us. Every house has a, you know, two, three, four hundred things that they're not using that they can um, put up for sale on Facebook. So there's plenty to go around. So guys, if you have any questions or comments, please put them in the comments section below. I'll be more than happy to answer them. I would love it actually if you guys share this video with friends and family. I wanna get the word out. I like to edutain, to share my knowledge with people, have a little bit of fun with it. And um, yeah, let's all go make some money, you guys. I hope you guys all have a great day and love what you do.